Hey everyone, I'm Anna the Singer, and today we're going behind the scenes of the songwriting process. I'm taking a class right now called Popular Songwriting, and in it, you basically learn the fundamentals of a pop music song. So the song I'm going to show you, I did on GarageBand, and it was made using a technique called loop-based composing, which basically just means that you take a bunch of software instrumental loops, which means that you can change the notation, or pre-recorded patches, which means you cannot change the notation, and you loop them together. Which means the song that you come out with is very formulaic, but at the same time very useful because it has all the fundamentals of most pop songs. Because of this, I figured I wouldn't be able to write something that sounded super amazing and original, especially since I'm using pre-recorded instrumental loops that are already in GarageBand and writing some of my own. Again, they're software instruments, which means I'm not playing them myself on an acoustic guitar, an electric guitar, or a piano, or anything like that. It's a digital instrument. Because of that, I decided that I wanted to go for a specific sound, and I chose the 80s. Uh, you don't know this about me yet, but I love the 80s. I know everything about the 80s. I have seen every 80s movie ever made. I forget that I wasn't born in the 80s all the time. My mom's a big 80s freak, which I think is probably where I get that from. And she actually was in high school in the 80s, which is amazing stories. Anyways, I decided to write this song in honor of the 80s. Uh, it doesn't have vocals yet. I have the lyrics written, but that's the last part that goes on. I will record those this weekend and then we'll have a full version of the song. But for now, you get to see the instrumental tracks. And I wrote the melody in there using a digital synth. When I record that, that won't be in there and it'll be my vocals. I hope you guys enjoy and I hope it reminds you of the 80s. we've got for today but I will be back this weekend hopefully with that full song written see you then